In this video, we're gonna be using Shannon Soap's Orange Ginger Twist and the Timeless Slim OC. Stay tuned. Hey there folks and welcome back for another video. I'm your OCDB and thanks so much for joining me today. I think we have a great one for you today. Boy, I'm excited about this one. But before we get into the video today, I wanna to remind you that this video is brought to you in part by our good friends at Leaf. I'll pop up the leaf and the twig right there. Really great razors. You know I love both the twig, the thorn and the leaf razors. Use them a lot on the channel. Use them far before any sponsorship, but I'm glad we partnered with Leaf because we can offer you a 5% discount if you use discount uh, code IMCDB. And at Leaf, remember, care for the places you care about. And boy, we care about this shave today because we have just an awesome one lined up for you. First, the soap. This is Shannon's Orange Ginger Twist. I love what Shannon's has done with the light. The label, look at that, that looks really nice. This right here is the Guardian, uh, or the Guardians of uh, Cleveland, I think Shannon told me, and I like the way they're um, sort of putting that they're, they have a collaboration. This is probably a Razor Company exclusive because it's a collaboration between Shannon's and the Razor Company. I really like this label, but boy, the notes, the notes, I'm gonna put them for you right there. I mean, when you read these, you gotta think, CDB. We have orange, lemon lime and ginger that's just, just like it's perfect for me it's perfect <laughs> i absolutely love this scent oh yeah the, the, i think i get mostly ginger forward and then you get the other elements and as you lather it you get some of the lime the lemon it's just fantastic the orange sort of in the back i think but it just comes across beautifully i would say the scent strength is one notch below medium but you can still pick it up so it's not too low by any stretch oh and awesome and you know the cost on this is great it's shannon's $15.99 for four ounces, and on our cost chart there, that is a good price of $3.99 an ounce, and this is a tallow-based soap. This is the Chupacabra base. We'll put the ingredients for you right there. Easy to work with, easy to lather, at least for me. I always get awesome lathers. Uh, if I remember, I'll put up a, a photo or two of the, of, uh, the brush. I took a little picture of the brush after I made the lather this morning because the, the, uh, the camera really never shows the sheen on the lather and Shannon's. Just produces such a fantastic lather. It's my favorite soap to lather, probably out of all the soaps. Um, I just enjoy it so much. All right, the razor for today is the Timeless Slim. You can see that head is pretty slim there with the open comb. I absolutely love this razor. It is, uh, the blade in it is Gillette Nasset. And I tell you what, Timeless, they still make fantastic razors. Just this one is got a 0.5 or 0 0.05 or something like that uh, blade gap. These start at 225, so Timeless is not an inexpensive razor, but I tell you, I've never been disappointed with a Timeless razor. This one is quite efficient, but it's not too efficient. It doesn't feel rough or anything like that. And boy, we look forward to using it today because uh, this is a phenomenal razor. And really all the razors I've tried at Timeless are phenomenal. So without further ado, let's get into it. We're gonna start by just applying some moisture to the face that's all this is plain water nothing special no special elixir or anything like that and we're going to be using our ap shave co brush again today this is their uh, handcrafted series there we go and man oh man i am looking forward to this one because this stuff smells great oh man it smells so good i love ginger um i just i think it's one of those notes that goes well with a lot of things it's underappreciated look at that look at that Shannon's is the stuff now, I'm gonna tell you. People are finally figuring it out. They started figuring it out finally in 2020. After years of us saying, you need to try this, this is good stuff, they finally started figuring it out. And welcome, welcome, if you're one of those people. And if you're not, give it a shot. There's plenty of companies that charge a lot more for their products and offer, in my opinion, um, less quality. And so, um, just make sure you find the scents that you like at Shannon's. The quality is just fantastic. It's one of my favorites. It's right up there with Ariana and Evans and, you know, plenty of others. I could go on naming soaps with fantastic quality all day long because there's a ton, but Shannon's does it and they do it at a really great price and they're great people too. So it's a win all around with Shannon's. They just did the, uh, the warrior soap. You might remember for Kim Gray. Hello, Kim. I hope you're doing well. Oh man, this one smells great. Oh, I love it. <laughs> this one is just going to be fun. 
Oh, let's get that cut back there so we can get into the shave. And it's, uh, it's been a couple of minutes since I've used the Timeless Slim. It's fantastic. So I'm just looking forward to a great shave today. Oh, I don't need my watch on. We don't need to know the time when we're making this video. We know what time it is. It's shaving time. All right, let's go. Very nice. The Gillette Masset Blade, I think, is a, is a probably what I would call, excuse me, a versatile blade. Just about every razor I've used it in, it's felt pretty good. So um, no problems with the blade. And the Timeless Slim here, it's designed to be slimmer in the head, you know, from top to bottom. So for those of you who shave under your nose, a little easier to reach under there than their standard offering. Although, you know, um, a lot of people like the standard offering as well, including me. Man, that's nice. Nice slickness on this. Oh, great scent that I'm enjoying immensely. <laughs> oh, this is just fun. When you get something you love, it just really brightens your day. And, uh, you know, I, you know, I know I've been touching on this, but you know, the channel really is a reflection here of my life and what's going on in my life. It always has been. And I tell you, some days are better than others. Um, you know, as you know, it's just, uh, it's, it's difficult some days. Yesterday was a, was another, you know, off day. My mom who has, you know, leukemia, leukemia and is undergoing chemo and she's, you know, quite ill some days. And yesterday she just, she was quite ill and not feeling well at all. And, uh, you know, I just take solace in the fact that I'm doing what I can to help. And then I enjoy, uh, another thing that really helps me is doing these shaves and enjoying this equipment. So now is a really bright spot for me. Um, you know, shaving, I love it. I love the comments, you know, I love to interact with people. And so this is a really a bright spot for me. And the fact that, you know, I'm just doing what I can to help. And so that, I, I feel good doing that. Um, but I, I would be lying if I saying it's, it's not rough to see because it surely is. But these shaves, the reason I bring this up, it, it really gives me a chance to get in here and just, you know, just enjoy myself. And the scent, it just, it does, I don't know. I can't tell you what it means to me because it, it just, I, it's really a bright spot. You know what I mean? And so it's just one of those things where it's more than just shaving, you know. I know a lot of times people will be in, the, in passionate debate and they'll go, it's just shaving. And you're right, you shouldn't be at each other's throats over it. But on the other hand, how many friends have we made because of this, you know? Um, and for me, it's just an excellent way to start out the day on the right foot, to get things going, to put things in motion and uh, try to, you know, just start off on a positive note. And that's the way I try to do it all the time. And then, you know, what the day might throw you later could be a little difficult, but we know tomorrow we're going to have another shave and we're going to enjoy the, the scent. I think the scents really mean a lot. And so the other day, you know, when you miss on a scent, it's disappointing. And then when you hit on one, it's such a high. And when you have a big miss, it's such a low. Um, <laughs> and so I really look forward to this. You know, it's one of those, I am somebody who enjoys the act of shaving every single day, you know. And I don't miss unless there's a compelling reason to miss a day. All right. Oof. Boy, I love this. This is fantastic. It's like the perfect scent for me. It's not just a lemon or a lime. I know a lot of people are like, oh, here he goes with another just citrus. The ginger just, for me, transforms, transforms it. Sorry if you hear the stomach growling there. Oh, man. I could just do this all day, honestly. I'm not going to but I could. <laughs> Whew. This is great. I'm loving it. All right. Let's stop. Cause if we don't stop, we're just going to go on and on and on with the lather in. And sometimes it's just fun. I know you have people like, um, Jack from the uh, virtual grooming who takes a lot of time to build his lather on his face. And the reason he does that is because he enjoys it. You know, it's, it's, and I completely understand because sometimes I get lost in it too. Just the act of, you know, just, I don't know, there's something therapeutic or, uh, I shouldn't say therapeutic, but there's, it, it's just calming to, you know, paint the face. And so some people like to show that and take a lot of time doing it. My videos would be too long if I showed the lather building every day. 
So I realize, you know, I, I, uh, I make so much content that I try to keep it under 20 minutes generally. I don't always hit that mark, but it's my goal to try to, to keep it to that level. Oh man, so nice. Great slickness on this soap. It was so easy to lather to get a great sheen on. And the scent is just fantastic. Total winner, total winner. It's just fantastic. And as you can see there, you know, I've been showing you recently how cleanly that uh, rinses. Now we're shaving on residual slickness there, which is no problem whatsoever with the Shannons. I would say if, if you have Shannons and you're not finding it slick enough, then you know work on the lather making because it should be. If you get the best out of it, it's gonna be really, really good. As good as anything else, honestly. And better than a lot of other things that probably get more praised, just to be completely frank with you. And this is something that I've felt and thought for a long time. Um, and I think sometimes because, because they offer it at such a decent price, people will just assume it's not as good as, you know, a $6 an ounce up. Wrong. <laughs> at least in terms of the shave. Now, when you get into post, I don't evaluate that. That's not part of my use case. I have post shave products for post, but in terms of making a fantastic lather, that you're going to, that comes easily, at least for me, and comes at a very good price, it's really hard to beat. It's really hard to beat. And this one is an absolute winner. It's, it's fantastic for me. Of course, I can't assure that every single person is gonna like the scent because, you know, scent is so subjective in what we like and don't like. And But for me, this is just a winner. And it's coming at a great time because now I'm seeing the pump, pumpkin stuff rolling out and I'm like, oh, <sighs> do we really need the pumpkin stuff already? Marion the other day sent a picture from Kroger. Kroger is a supermarket uh, here in the east and southeast. Um, and it had pumpkin pie ice cream sandwiches. Do we need pumpkin pie ice cream sandwiches? No. I'm sure some of you are going, yes, but the pumpkin stuff is like, it's, can we, can we still have summer, please? Can we still have summer? No, we can't evidently. We gotta move right into the, the fall, the dank, the dark, the, you know, the dead, winter. <laughs> People are anxious to get into it. I am not, I am not. I love spring and summer where things are bright, things are coming alive. That's what I'm about. I'm about living, embracing that. I'm not about dark, dead, damp, decay. Who wants that? Some people do, I guess. I don't mind the heat, you know, obviously if I were working outside, it, it wouldn't be my favorite, but you know, summer, I just love it. I just love that things are alive and the birds and the bees and the, you know, all the plants and the flowers, everything's in full bloom and vivid. I mean, what's not to like about that? I mean, I don't know, I guess the heat you could say, but anyway, phenomenal, phenomenal shape. I tell you what, that was just fantastic. All right, let me rinse. And then we shall come back and get into the post. Stay tuned. And all right, we are back in Ockham. We did a warm water rinse to remove the soap. And then we applied our trusty Razor Rock alum. No stains. That was a super smooth shave. No necks, guts, creepers, weepers, irritation, bubbles, or troubles. That's how we do. Very, very nice shave. Uh, following the alum, we did a cool water rinse. And then we towed off with our Lancaster towel prior to applying the magic made by witches. Thayer's Witch Hazel Cucumber. Excellent shave today with Shannon's Orange Ginger Twist. Pros, the label, they've tightened it up, excellent. Uh, very good cost, excellent quality. Cons, there's no cons with this soap. Um, I can't think of any reason whatsoever to complain. The price is right, right excuse me, the price is right. You remember Bob Barker, the price is right? Anyway, the price, <laughs> the price is right. The quality is top rate, great company, great people. The Razor Company too, you throw that in there, that's a winner. That's a winner. What are you waiting for? This one is great if you like citrus scents. I love it. Anyway, I can't say enough good things about this. This might be my favorite scent from Shannon's of all time. I love it. So fantastic. No reason not to try that if you like citrus in my opinion and ginger, of course. Uh, the Timeless OC today, again, um, pros. Outstanding in every, <laughs> in every way. Nice, efficient, great fit and finish. 
on these razors. Excellent slim head. The only con associated with this would be um, it's pricey. It starts at $225 and depending on whether you want open combs, scallops and all that. It could be more expensive, but it is an amazing shaver. Definitely one of my favorites. I love it. So that was awesome too. Uh, of course, we had our AP Shave Co. Uh, handcrafted series brush with cashmere knot. And there is our Lancaster Razor Works uh, brush soaking mug. And we're going to finish it out today with Shannon Soaps. This is the orange uh, ginger twist splash. And a gentleman did bring this up and I've heard this before. So maybe this is the one con today, I guess you would say. You see the level there on the splash? That's something that I hear quite a bit from people and a gentleman mentioned it in the unboxing yesterday. I didn't notice it at first, but the splash is almost all the way down to the label. Uh, and that is something that has been brought up. I think it's legit. Uh, now that said, I don't know what the volume, the fluid volume is supposed to be. So this could be exactly what's supposed to be in the bottle. But because you see a lot of companies have it up on the neck there, or at least close to the neck, um, someone brought that up. So that's something to think about. Uh, however, it could be exactly the amount that's supposed to be in here. I don't know if it says. So anyway, let's get this on. Let's get on with the day. And I hope wherever you guys are, and gals, of course, you're having a great day. Oh man. And also another con for some people with these splashes would be um, no alcohol. So this is not an alcohol based splash. It's more like a toner, but I still like it. Oh man, because I like this scent. It's not an in your face citrus blast especially on on the um the the splash i prefer the soap scent to the splash honestly this one's a little more subdued um but i still like it it's nice <laughs> all the same anyway thanks so much folks i appreciate you being here so much we've had an excellent shave today i hope you have enjoyed it till next time i've been your host cdb reminding you it's your shave do it your way and as always god bless <laughs>